Kind einfach hier. <lacht> All right, guys, welcome to the Yacht Yacht Show. We are back on the club, the hunting club, to where if I catch a certain amount, I get a membership to hunt here. And as y'all saw, my wife knocked down that big old buck this year with all those pigs that I caught. <laughs> but that being said, we're on the quest to 60. We got to at least catch 60. I done brought the big boy out, the big 30, 40 foot panel trap with four doors. And you know what I say? Four doors, more boards. Come on. Any which way. I watched them last night go in here, but we caught pigs in another spot, right? You may have already seen that video. Not sure yet, but we caught them. We had trouble, but they down. I watched them with the whole guy camera system. Watch what was going on. There's a lot of greedy uh, boars in here, a lot of greedy pigs trying to be bullies and whatnot. So what we're going to do is strategically place that corn in here to maybe maximize our catch tonight. I want to catch 30, catch 20, 25. We shall see. All I know is I'm getting serious. It's game on. The quest to 60 on the hunting club right now, right here. Come on. Me and JP was... Me and JP was uh, skunk hunt, uh, skunk, not skunk hunting. We were skunk trapping the other day, and uh, I was trying to film him skunking and trying to be real quiet. And this guy goes, hey, there's some skunks over there. <laughs> I said, yeah, and he, and he seen the pigs that was in the back of the truck, and he was like, oh, you got pigs? <laughs> I was like, could you be quiet? <laughs> So, a lot of times you would think you want the corn on the back of the trap. I do, but my camera system doesn't quite see that back there. So what I know is where my line is, and my line is about where you can see this corn is right here. All right, that's gonna get a lot of our bigger holes right there. Now the bigger holes are gonna be center. Most of the corn is gonna be, what we're gonna do is kinda of place some on the outer edges, that way when the big hogs is here, the smaller hogs can be away from them, right? And that way they just won't be running, shooting in and out and doing all that. So that's the plan of action anyway. We shall see. So yesterday, you put out how many pounds of corn? 150 pounds. 150 pounds yesterday. And it's gone today. And it's gone today. And uh, I would put 200 today, but I only got three sacks in this Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> what I learned over the last five years is I was born to put out corn. How much corn do you get through a week? A week, a ton at least, minimum, 40 bags. <laughs> so we'll watch that door right there, make sure we don't get any. That's gonna be our smaller pig right there. So, I'll leave them corn sacks in there and give them something to play with. This is how a professional puts out corn, just in case anybody knows. It may look unprofessionalized to the, to the untrained eye, but David, just so you know, you're with a professional corn pour. This is not your first rodeo, is it? <laughs> and it's gonna look like a rodeo uh, come tomorrow if we catch these pigs, so be ready. It's gonna be a lot of haul draw, uh, dragging. See the move? That's how you go.
morning. Hey. It's got to get better, right? <laughs> We've been rolling. <laughs> We've been rolling. Oh, uh, I actually I think we're gonna go down there in my truck and walk. I seen one on the outside. I just wanna check and make sure that uh you know he don't get away. If he don't then we can still walk up there and do our thing. Sound good. It's not as cold as it was yesterday, but it's still cool. But uh the amount of dragging that we may have to do to get these pigs on the trailer. I feel like since the high is going to be 67 today, I feel like it's probably going to be 67 about five pigs in. <laughs> Dragging them up is what I feel like. Oh. But yeah, the plan is to go up here and just see if there's one pig that happened to come up to the outside of the pen uh, to see if he's up here. And if he is, uh, we're going to try to put a uh, headshot on him with the 22 mag and I uh, hope it goes well. And if he's not there still, then, uh, well, We'll just get doing our thing. The head knocking on the inside the trap, you know. Either way, we got some pigs. Either way, it's gonna be some head knocking. And I don't know if, I, if you've seen it, but there's a set of gates up there. And when you see the gates, the head knocking awaits. Come on. <laughs> Let me see him. Let's see if I can pull it up right here. My phone was acting fun. Look at the pigs in there. And that other pig was over there on the side. So we're just gonna slip to the woods you see in the background right there. And uh, we're just gonna look up there and see if we can't see that pig or whatnot. So hopefully that stray pig is still out there. And uh, we'll get a shot on him with this 22 mag. See how it goes. What's wrong? But once we go in this, the green fields, what's that 75 yards? And we turn right there and there, there should be another 75 yards or so right there. So we're gonna slip up to the green field, look, see what we got. If the, if the hog is not there, uh, uh, then we won't shoot him, but we'll have to go get back to get 22. I don't want to tote a bunch of stuff over here. So. Scope might be on the other side. I can't. Not seeing him. We can come around and look. I guess we can go back to the truck and get the 22 head knocker. We pop them in the trap. How many things in there? I think 25, but I'm hoping for 30 to get that new catch, that new catch record, but we'll see. My gosh. It's foggy. right here <laughs> don't you let me forget it like I did yesterday <laughs> I'm gonna leave it here because when we walk back just in case that that stray pigs mm -hmm. in the woods and comes back out yep. we'll have something. our lucky's gonna be up there huh? our lucky's gonna cross about right there <laughs> yeah. we'll lay the gun down and he'll come right <laughs> got my man D Mac Mac Wayne we're coming in on the pig right now. David's been filming for me the last couple of days. We're doing beavers, hogs. We done tore up stuff. And now we're supposed to be on these pigs. He finna get his first hand on dragging these dudes on a trailer, you hear me? Let's go see what we got right here, son. Golly, look right here. Oh, my 
Yeah. Man, that one right there, man. Oh yeah. Oh my. Let me get that big. Get that big. Show me your ear. We got a load and we had some bag ones in here, so we're gonna. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how many it is, but we got a load. I'm gonna tell you something. This is definitely land management right here when you take out this many pigs at one time. So I guess we just get the head knocking, Dave. Got a lot of work to do. <laughs> a lot of work to do. <sighs> oh, man. You gotta land down there, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. They don't like you for some reason. Yeah. They didn't hurt about me. They didn't hurt about me. So, so we had to knock down that big pig. He's pretty tough, pretty hard headed, but you, if you noticed how calm these pigs got once you got the crazy one knocked out. Uh, a lot of times you have one or two in the crowd that just act up and uh it makes everybody else act up kind of like in life you know so all you kids out there <laughs> if you hang around a bunch of people don't act right don't you be acting like them so but you see once we got uh oh my face once you see how once we got him knocked down the rest of them kind of chilled so and that's kind of where we're at right now so uh just proves if you got that bully hog that wild hog in the group in the trap go and get him knocked down and then the rest of them should calm down for the most part so let's get back to this Well, we only had to load about three times. Oh, it's 15 shells. <laughs> so we got a pretty good many hogs, I would say. Oh. <sighs> the work began, so I guess we go back and get the ranger and the trailer, and oh, I guess we go and get these drug out and get a few pictures, and the work begins, Dave. <laughs> the work begins. I'm glad I brought the tripod. Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. we to be, we're gonna need all the work we can get. Oh uh, man, we're gonna need all the help we can get, that's for sure. We got a load. They gonna get heavier and heavier the more we pull. So, any hose, let's get it. Let's get to work. Thirty. I think it's thirty. I think it's thirty. I ain't good at adding, but uh, <laughs> if it's thirty, that's a new yacht yacht wild hog catch. Uh, since I've been doing this in 2017, I had 29. I think we just got 30. The landowner said he saw 29 in one picture, so, and we had one on the outside, so with 30, 31, so we got 30 out of the 31 that I saw. So we hoping, fingers crossed, we'll be able to count better when they get lined out, but let's go get what we need to get the dragon. Oh, 
Yeah. They say we ride at dawn, but we knock heads at dawn. All right, I'm on video, and uh, you get to work. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get these gloves on. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm gonna let you set your tripod up. <laughs> uh, we gotta get them lined out, get us a picture. And, uh, you know, we put a lot of effort. A lot of people don't understand, you know, the steps that we go through, and especially as, uh, trying to get, uh, what's, what's it called? Get the video out there, and, and so you can see everything and how it goes. So it's a lot of extra steps uh, to make sure this happens. So I hope y'all really enjoy what we're doing, because a lot of it is we're doing it for y'all as well. So that being said, Time for the gun show. Get the muscles out. <laughs> Can't even pull them sleeves up. The muscles so tight. Now I signed up to film. I didn't sign up to be doing all this dragging. Now. Well, see the the contract it 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 varies from from actually like minute to minute. So you <laughs> you never know what you're gonna get with y'all, y'all man. <laughs> but we gotta get these gates up first, and uh, once we get them up, we're just gonna pull them on out and uh, get us get us a little old hero shot there, man. I'm just glad that we could knock out. What we think is 30 pigs, and we won't know until we line them up. You know, us Mississippi boys, we had to line them up. We can't, we can't count them in a circle very well. <laughs> yeah, come film. Come film. It'll be easy, man. It'll be real easy. <laughs> hey, I need a film guy. That's all. 30 pigs later. I think I'm hired help right now. I think I am. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't right. know what you consider hired. <laughs> good work. Uh, Doing good. Hey. I'm just tr I'm just showing you how it's supposed to be done right now. Yeah. <laughs> That's style, ain't it? Woo! That ain't even the biggest. <laughs> Woo! That's style, old son. Oh yeah. All right. You want to double team these? I think we might have to. Yeah, I think so too. Oh. Well, uh, I don't know if I got a bigger one. Alright, one more. Thanks. Y'all go to yawkyawk.com and get these pocket drags to help you drag something. Hey man, how you doing, sir? Man, we just got the pigs on the trailer. Okay, okay, that's good. That's good. Uh, yeah. Yes, I uh I'm not rabbit hunting right now, but I'll be back by 10.30. The trailer already parked up for you. Okay, well, I may end up uh, just leaving my trailer there. Oh, okay. Man, it's, it's, it, it's, uh, it's a couple pigs. They kind of big. They kind of big. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, all right. Oh, I know what it is. It's, uh, it's 30. <laughs> Well, ten of them, ten of them piglets. So, okay. yeah. But the rest of them, uh, they gonna fill a couple of them fill a freezer. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, but I'll head to your house here shortly. All right, yeah. All right, see ya. Yeah. Yeah, rabbit hunt. Well, he better hope he don't catch a bunch of rabbits. He got the skin because his knife already gonna be dull from this right here. Whoo, David. Thirty. We we gotta make it through that hole right there. We gotta make it through that hole. If we don't make it through that hole, I'm gonna be walking back to my truck. Well, he ain't, uh, he ain't gonna get 30 pigs. <laughs> he, don't, he, don't, he don't get about 15 because some of them coming off him. Oh, but anyway, we got it. 30 pigs taken out of this one spot, one drop. I'm halfway there. This is the quest is 60. We're halfway there with one drop. We need 30 more pigs and we can hunt this property for the rest of the year and next season. So let's do it. Reset this again. It's done. It's ready. You ready to go? Yeah. All I got, I mean, it's got corn in there. I mean, a little bit. They'll still come in here and sniff around. It smells like hogs. So they'll know. Uh, but I'll come back and probably put a bag of corn in there. But uh, right now, for today, I'm going to leave it like it is. And if we get one or two more coming in there, we'll drop it and move on to the next spot. It never ends, does it? It never ends. It never ends. But we're trying to make it to the end right now. <laughs> Come on. How many pounds do it is? <laughs> it's overloaded. That's all I can. <laughs> <sighs> all right, wish us luck. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's see what it do. I just 
like to take a minute to thank the Lord for letting us out of that hole. Now we can, since we knocked the heads, we can go feed the families, doing what we can. Come on. You got a little mud back there. Keep them cool. That mud keep them cool, see? <laughs> Traffic. If it's got fur feelings, we'll knock it in the head. But my wife said you better leave them feeling long now, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got a little mud. Oh, they'll love that. Yes, sir. David, do you think it would have made it, this, this load would have made it on that trailer we used yesterday? Oh, yeah. <laughs> As you can see, the tire. <laughs> uh oh. I got a tire problem. Oh, you're talking about squatting? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Look at there. That's all right. We actually use these jugs right here to, uh, some cornerstone jugs of water to clean the pigs off. But as you can see, they ain't got a lot more mud on them. But anyway, set it right here. We are done. The Quest of 60 on the hunting club is halfway there. 30 pigs down in the first drop on the club. Woo! Now, we've done the head knocking. Now we're going to go feed the families. Come on. Any which way. Y'all subscribe. Go to yachtyacht.com. Help the channel grow. I really appreciate it. Uh, boy, what else? Just thank you. We're knocking heads and feeding families. We're going to keep going, so y'all know how it goes. Y'all have a good one. God bless. And as always, Jesus loves you. Ah!